Welcome back to Mage. I'm Sean. I'm Chris. This is Tower of God, chapters 361 to 365. So we were, yeah, it's another early Sunday, by the way. Uh, <laughs> anyway, we were just catching up with uh, one of our favorite characters of the series already. He said like already. What, three panels. <laughs> <laughs> so Kun Idan. Exactly. Yes. He's looking very clean so far. He not, is. not sure about his character just yet, but he looks very cool. <laughs> looks very nice. Um, there wasn't too much in the comments, other than the whole like sister comment that we know. Like I figured that was Kuhn, but uh, I figured that was Adan, but you know. I thought it was it his sister. The shading. Yeah. yeah. The shading was a little bit different. It was, and yeah. I didn't see him have like long hair in the other panels. That's and what kind he of was talking off. to the sister as well. That's why I thought. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah. I mean, I'm fine with oh. that being a dino. It was a great um, panel. <laughs> yeah. All right. Um, yeah, not much else happened other than a dawn, But not much else needed to happen because yeah. a dawn They're is a beast already for us. <laughs> They're exploring the next few floors. Uh, the next uh, stage, sorry, of the hidden floor. Mm. And Kuhn and Hansung got stopped by the breeder. So, yeah. Mm. All right. I reckon we get into it. So uh, we have a Discord down below. Check it out and let's go. All right, three sixty one. Bro, this is the uh, um, Dorsey's friend, yeah. Versus Armadillo Man. He's growling a lot. Okay. Snake Man's just wrapping around. Huh. Actually, just like wrapping him up. Mm-hmm. Oh, yep. where is that? He's gone. Oh my goodness. <laughs> he is gone. Paching. <laughs> turned into a needle? What? And then it just like slams into its head. Half the screen is red. Huh, that's probably not good. Yeah, that thing dead. <laughs> <laughs> I reckon Bam could do that if he like focused his Shinsu. Should Bam be focused, he could do a lot of things. That, maybe he needs to get hit by it. <laughs> Alright, so the thing's like screaming. Ah. As you would be. Needle to the head would do that to someone. That is a sizable hole. He's gone. Just like that. It's over, princess. <laughs> I like this man. He's efficient. Hmm. Let's go. Oh, Bam's getting Bam's some chills. Yeah. Wow. Okay. What? Coon's Lighthouse stole the villain? <laughs> oh. So you're saying that Coon is the one who stole that villain before? Well, probably. But why? It's a good question. I'm not sure, but it seems certain that he's trying to interfere with our quest. They haven't been teammates with Bam long, so they probably don't know that he'd be doing it for a reason. Maybe the big breeder is his enemy. Oh, um, maybe not. We've got a, bi we've got a big brain over here. There we here. go. We'd better hurry. Oh, they're legging it. Kun Idan, part four. All right. Hell yeah. <laughs> You'll help us? Uh, who do oh. you think you are <laughs> helping us? All oh, right. All yeah, right. <laughs> well, we hate the big breeder too. What? Rack, just stab her now. Yeah, save everyone. Just do it. Uh, it's only VR. <laughs> uh, save the details for later. I'll infuse your spear with a special power. What? That will definitely help you. That's cheating. My spear. <laughs> Look at him. My spear? Yes. If you want a more special and more stronger spear, right? Hmm. <laughs> a more, more special, special and stronger spear. <laughs> Oh my god. It's so simplistic. It's fantastic. You're amazing, Rack. Damn it, I lose. <laughs> he can truly show them who the leader is. Sure, I'll allow it. <laughs> eh, now you gotta deliver. Doesn't take much. Great, this gives me an excuse to join their team. As long as you do it. Oh. Several hours earlier, the hidden, hidden floor, big breeder Chung's residence. What, you want them... You want to travel with them? Yes. 
Mm. I'm going to use that machine to disguise myself and travel with them. It will be as careful as possible uh, so that the other big breeder won't notice. If you help me, I'll help you get out of here too. She has no idea how though, right? Yeah, she's making a lot of promises she can't keep. She is. Uh, I don't understand. Isn't your goal to bring them here? There are still some companions of mine there that I haven't met. I'm not leaving this place until I find them. So I'm going to travel with them to find my companions, as well as find out what they're up to. That way, I can achieve my goal in coming to this place. Oh. <laughs> this is where I might be starting to think, can I really trust this? <laughs> Uh, what on earth is your goal in coming here? You people are completely different from outsiders I've seen so far. There's something that we need to get. Jihad has it. We need to defeat Jihad and get it. She says that so casually. Like she's going to be of any use in the... F oh, I mean, exactly. She has, that new, she has the new weapon, whatever it is. That oh, That is true, I guess, yeah. But then again, she's not useful. Yeah, yeah. Uh, choose. Will you risk the danger of helping me escape, helping me and escape from here? Or will you stay stuck here? They're going to fight Jihad. <laughs> They're crazy. You don't want to be stuck here for the rest of your life, tormenting the daughter of people in here, do you? Oh. All right, I'll help you. Really? But be careful. Uh, the big breeders are stronger than me. They can't find out who we are. Okay. You're that man from before. Oh. Uh, I have an idea what's going on here. You were trying something stupid with the heroes who came to this place and I ruined your plans. <laughs> oh, similar to uh, what's happening now. Hansel. Uh, you alone vanished somewhere, so I couldn't find you. But I didn't think you would be up to something like this again. What? What on earth are you doing this for, <laughs> you lowly daughter creature? That's a good panel right there of him. Uh huh. You were harassed by that guy too? Harassed? Tell me the truth. It's nothing to be ashamed of. I'll get back at him for you. Uh, how would you get back at him? Now, enough of this nonsense. He whips out a sweet looking staff. It's uh, time to punish you. And they're making a bloody black hole. Yeah, everyone's good at that, <laughs> apparently. Okay. What's this? Oh, never mind. <laughs> okay. You summon the moon from Majora's Mask with horns. <laughs> okay. Uh, what's what that? What is that? There's another strange thing that looks like where Coon is. Oh my goodness, he has like a lightning dagger. <laughs> is that mm. Andros? They're like, they look like they're like further away, I guess. Yeah, much further away. They must have gotten pretty far. Oh, oh. crap, what's that? <laughs> Moon. <laughs> he looks like he's ready for a fight. Okay. I mean, obviously, but... Uh, let's run. What? What about the Grand Quest? That's not the issue right now. That stone guy is the stone general. He's on a completely different level from the soldiers we've faced so far. What? Uh, if you want to live, run. Hey! Oi, oi. <laughs> Summon a rain of stones, Stone General. Okay. Hole. Okay, that's, that's borderline meteors, but... <laughs> mm. Okay, he's just flinging them straight at him. Very, Crap. I don't very, know if that's going to do enough. It's coming in with such speed. That bastard. Ooh, what's Hansung up to? Oh, he's like ripping him away. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I think you're right. That would have just cracked straight through. Yeah. What are you doing? I should be asking you the same thing. Were you trying to block that? You can't <laughs> block it anyway. There it is. <laughs> Uh, the stone general can summon a never-ending rain of stones. Never-ending? Yes, an infinity rain of stones. You may be able to block his attack for now, but you can't keep up forever. Oh, okay. 
Oh, oh yes. That's quick. Boys. Coon. Bam. Two bam. Bam times two. Is it arrived? Uh, bam, watch out. Oh, okay, immediately. A meteor is coming. And they're away. Bong bong. Oh, yes. How'd the quest go? I'm oh, just casually having conversations while meteors rain from the sky. So they they jump, like yeah. <laughs> Not bad. Uh, uh, we beat it. Now we just have to move on. Is that so? So the problem is bringing candy with us. Hmm. And that guy, I knew there would be more of them. Ooh, this guy's on it. Oh, here we go. Bam, Coon, it's you guys. Wow, they got here quick. Without mm. a bong bong. They were further away than... <laughs> They were moving. What happened? Have we been deceived by the big breeder? Hmm. She sure is quick. Uh, what's going on, big breeder? Why are you attacking our companions? I'm sorry. It seems like our companions are breaking the rules of this place. What? I have no choice but to enforce oh. the law. Oh. <laughs> uh, summon. Uh, summon the lightning storm. Stone General. What? Now. Now. Wait. Did okay. you just fire a lightning bolt? Oh. What is this? Wait. Wait. It's... Hold on. This is Rack. 100%. Well, you wish it was Rack. This is Coon. Adan. 100%. <laughs> it does look powerful. But I think the Red Spear. Mm. I think it's a lightning bolt. That would be cool. Who is it? Or it's him. Or it's him. Oh, I don't know. No, he let go of that thing. Ooh. Oh, yeah, someone's attacked him. Okay. Yeah, for sure. I it's... will be shocked if this is Rack. It was Rachel put the enchantment on the spear, dude. <laughs> Rachel has nothing to... Rachel can't do shit. That She's just an a admin. lie. <laughs> Big fat lie. Look at this. Whatever hit it is like... Not just some kind of beam. It has to be a spear. I think it's Rack. Okay, so the staff is on the floor. I do not believe this crap. <laughs> is that like I'm I'm happy for I'm happy for Rack, but Rachel being useful is just unbelievable to this, me. This this ain't a power up though. I feel like. No no no, it's just a power up in this place. Yeah, it's a virtual power up. Is that the mad shocker? Rack spear just comes in. There he is. Turtles. Rack. <laughs> okay. oh, the God. fact that she has she is useless here is insane to me right now. <laughs> Useful here. <Yes>. Right. <laughs> uh, you only here. Yes. <laughs> only in the virtual world can she be useful at the moment. So far that we've seen. Uh you I saw you in the village of the wandering minstrel. Hurry. We have to go to another stage right now. Okay. All right. Damn it. <laughs> you bastards. Oh, they zoom in. Okay, that was quick. Did they take candy and... Yeah, I'd assume Snorlax? they just took everyone. Yeah, they took everyone. Okay, yeah, I think so. There we we go. made it. <laughs> that was incredible timing, Rack. <laughs> the dab Rack returns. This double dab. What's going on here? <laughs> Alligator? <laughs> You're alive? But who are you? Oh, she's seeing mm. the interface from the other side. I appreciate you helping us. You helped us beat the quest in the village before too, didn't you? Uh, I don't know about help. She, like, stopped a rat. Hmm. Here we go. I'm... I'm the big breeder's sworn enemy. Um, okay. Interesting introduction. <laughs> what? A sworn enemy? You all have sworn enemies too, right? I'm created by the mirror in order to achieve a balance with the big breeder. Hmm. I was able to be born when you opened the gate and came in. Do you know anything about this too, Hansung? Nope. This is the first time I'm hearing this. You guys want the power to face the big breeder, right? Then I'll help you. 
It's a good thing Chung told me about sworn enemies in his office. They've already had the tour of this place. Didn't include... What should we do, Kuhn? I'm not sure. There's a lot about this that I find suspicious. Ask if she knows Rachel. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't seem like a bad turtle. She's strengthening my spear. That's all it takes to make you happy. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so it, wouldn't it be bad to go together for now, wouldn't it? Would it? Mm. She's suspicious in a lot of ways, but she definitely seems to have the power to stand up to the big breeder. Maybe we should just go with her for now and keep an eye on her. People who, who have that VR headset are broken. <laughs> well, they're admins, of course. Exactly. Alright, let's go together. That's easy. Thank you. Great. Mission success. Mm. No. Mm. Damn it. Oh, this must be the goat breeder, I guess. Big yeah. Oh. oh. Yes. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, so they all have... They're all VR people. So he throws the helmet on the ground. It's breathing. The hidden floor. Those bastards. Main body of the big breeder, Geoc. He looks like Prince. <laughs> oh, wait oh, this is the sister. Oh, I think you're right. Uh, oh, she you. saw him. <laughs> Aguero. Wait. Does she know? Wait, how does she? How does she know Coon? That's Coon's name. Great, Agnes. Yeah, that's Coon's name. The and that's the sister. Hmm, could this, no, hmm, wait, how, she knows, okay. dude, she, she's close, but, <sighs> wait a minute, how does she know Coon, what should I oh, do, oh, like, a gear, you know, our Coon, yeah, <laughs> is this the sister, that he kind no. of, you no. don't, hmm. I don't think so, she knows, oh, it could be, she know oh. it is <laughs> <laughs> hmm. <laughs> I want to kill him lovely <laughs> I'm so confused it's not supposed to update now I go home but you're drunk it's up it updated best present I was so disappointed when it didn't update this morning but it's back it must have been late guessing the All late three. chapter yeah alright okay. fair enough next one someone wants to kill Coon boys uh 362 as the big breeder was looking stunned. This must have been like before he signed out, I guess. What should I do now? Should I go to the next stage and capture those guys? But it would be difficult if they've disappeared into the hidden stage. Oh, Geok. Is this the third breeder? Uh, Huang. This seems to be a problem. Yes, the new data humans are behaving strangely. Uh, do they know about, do they, wait, sorry, <laughs> do they know the secret floor hidden? Oh my Jesus. Well, English. English. Look at this. <laughs> oh, this is what happens when you do it in the morning. Do they know the secret of the hidden floor? I think so. Although they don't seem to know any more than that, of course. Thank you. My brain. He's got a Comprehending voice. two sentences. This could be, uh, oh, no, no. Is that so? Hole. Someone has actually entered the king's cradle. What? <laughs> is the king's cradle? That person is probably one of their companions. They're clearly not ordinary people. I have no idea what their purpose in coming here might be. Don't do anything rash to them until Lord Jihad gives you orders. And assign the sworn enemies to their opponents. Okay. They have direct control over them. But we could incur even greater wrath if we failed to control them. It would make things even more difficult for us if Lord Adan or the scale maintaining the balance got involved. The important thing is to annihilate them at once. Okay. So Adan is a threat. <laughs> Obviously. Obviously. But I'm surprised they know that like Adan is actually here. Yeah, or yeah, I, I would assume that they 
Wouldn't they have been entered around the same... Oh, no, Jihad came first, didn't he? And then, like, the rest came. Yeah. It's, yeah, hmm. Hmm. Uh, don't forget that our top priority is to protect it and hide the location of Lord Jihad. We'll deal with those guys if they try to approach the scout. I'm assuming it is what, um... The leader of the Ten Great Families wanted from BAM. Yeah, um... I've forgotten his name. <laughs> I was going to say Galahad, but I've been playing Fate recently, so that's not it. Gustard. Gustang, yes. <laughs> Gustang. Gustang. <laughs> Just needed the G. Yes. Uh, Everything is understood. Oh, that's coffee. Uh, so what should we do now? If we run into the big beater again in the next stage, there's a high chance of that, but still, you can't give up on finding your companions, can you? Yeah, we still need to find white boys. He's on our side. Uh, reinforcements will come and come once you and Darn meet. I think we should keep being the stages and looking for your companions. Oh, Rachel and Darn. <laughs> <laughs> Who that? Uh, I guess we have no choice. Let's keep going. Oh, yes. Rough let. But that's strange. I felt a really intense chill while we were in the stage until a minute ago. But now it's disappeared as if it was never there. Could he sense his... Although it was a kind of cold place. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he sensed her. It was just the intent. Wait, the really intense chill, was that Kuhn's sworn enemy then? Not part of... <gasps> oh, not part of... No, um... wait. Sworn enemies can't speak, though. Bams can. They just... All they want to do is fight, though. They just... Wait, did Bam... Did Viol speak? Yeah, when Bam asked him a question, he's like, uh, he's, oh, Bam really? was asking him to surrender, and he's just like, no, nah, I want to kill you. <laughs> okay, okay. And this one specifically said, I want to kill Coon. That could be a sworn okay. enemy. Uh, what, what on earth could it have been, that biting cold? Is Coon's worst enemy his sister? Coon Edan, part five. Okay. Two days later. Oh, me time skip. Oh. Uh, Team Borrow, the hidden stage. I like how we jump a lot in the times, because yeah. if you go to like other anime, manga kind of stuff, a it takes forever to go from yeah. like, you know. There's like travel time and stuff before you get to the next big thing. Yeah. But it's not even that, it's just like, they very rarely skip days. Yeah. Like if you look at One Piece, <laughs> since the since the time skip, just a quick tangent, it's been three weeks and they're in Wano. They got around, you know. <laughs> <laughs> like, what do you mean? <laughs> yeah, it, it's all happened, like, super quickly. And you were... I like how the time is more is more realistic. Yeah. In Tower of God. Like, yeah, One Piece. They've been to, what, four, five islands almost since they yeah, entered the Yeah, in three weeks. World. I didn't know boats travel that fast. Ships, yeah. rather. Anyway, they fly now. <laughs> off the tangent, uh, Team Borrow the hidden stage. They finally arrived. Look at him drawing pad out. A true artist, boys. That's Ooh. where my father is. It's just like man a got his own star. Oh no, no, no! That is a tower. Is it a tower? I think so. I thought it was a star, like lighting. <laughs> yeah, it'd be pretty cool. Oh no, you're right. It's a tower. Oh, it looks like residence of Kun Adan's daughter. The place of the palace of spears. Oh. Of course he spears. He just throws lightning at people. <laughs> mm -hmm. We got Anil over here. <laughs> uh, finally, we're here, Sachi. Although you didn't really do much except push the button on the measuring device. Dude, Boris freaking out. Uh, hey, what do you mean? I beat your. S oh, I beat that sworn enemy. You know what? That's right. We suffered the most thanks to you. Your sworn enemy was a monster from a movie you saw when you were little. What? Shut up, Sachi. It was really scary. <laughs> yeah, I guess it was pretty strong. Who's a real this? pain in the On the, the neck. rock. Oh, yeah. Um, blue hair with a cloak. You're late. Hole. Huh? A woman? Oh, okay, so this is the sister, I'm assuming. Yeah, okay. Who's there? A woman's voice. Oh. My goodness, that's a big sword. <laughs> okay. Okay. 
She looks like a really young version of um... <gasps> Oh. <laughs> oh. Uh, uh, matching. Okay. Straight up. Uh, why? I think that's supposed to be what took you so long, Asensio. Our father left this place because he got sick of waiting. Why is she coming out with his sword drawn straight at this man? Uh oh. Wait, that kid is Maschini? She's small. Oh my goodness. That's rude, Bora. <laughs> Watch what you say about her. <laughs> She's just like that because she cleared the train when she was still young. I'll say. Her name is Kuhn Maschini Jihad. Don't talk about the out. Wait. Don't talk about the outside me, Asenio. <laughs> She's one of the most powerful princesses on the outside, who was given one of the thirteen-month series. Mm. She's about to compete with Yuri for a few more. What thirteen-month princess? That's right. She's a remarkable person. I said, stop it. I'm blushing. <laughs> <laughs> But Mass Cheney, what did you mean father disappeared? He's gone. Uh, it's exactly what I said. He waited for you all day yesterday, but he must have gotten impatient because he left without saying a word. Well, that's not good. <laughs> huh. Well, still, father has a strong presence no matter where he is. It should be easy to find him. Okay. Oh. Is that him? <laughs> My man just flies with lightning. Yeah. He's so fast. <laughs> Must be over there. Oh. Watch out. He's like, what is this creature? It's like brawling with a dinosaur or something. Oh, never mind. A it's... griffin dragon? Yeah. yeah. That thing would have been cooked if it got hit by that. Okay, he's just... Oh, man's out here training. Here we go. <laughs> Woo. I like how he's got, like, the... Uh, down each finger. Oof. Look at man that. Man looks clean. A body doesn't cool off once it heats up. Oof. <laughs> Can't wait to meet you, son of the... Oh, damn. Okay. We know who that is this time. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. Dude, everyone oh. wants to meet him. Okay, I just... Uh, this would be interesting, because, like, if, um... He knows who, like, Son of V is kind of thing. It would be a fresh memory to him. Yeah. And then it's like, oh, but this Adan doesn't get, like, the memories don't go to the Adan outside the tower. So it's like, you know, that Adan wouldn't give a crap about Kuhn because of, because he knows Son of V. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. Oh, that is true. Oh. Because, like, Kuhn said he doesn't like his dad. He doesn't and like I, his dad, but Kuhn is like... Yeah. I just, yeah. Okay. Kuhn would have we'll to prove going. himself in, like, to his mm. dad in here for him to care about him. Oh. Team Raccoon Bam. Raccoon Bam. Nice. Okay. That's a good name, actually. Raccoon Bam. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds like Raccoon Bam. <laughs> Stage 7. The Labyrinth of the Minotaur. Stage 7? What? Dude, Rack's just throwing his spear and they're yeah, all dying. Rack, Rack's OP at the moment. Rack got is... the power up we always wanted, except it's going to disappear when he gets out. He's unknowingly using hacks. I wonder if it will stay. I feel like he needed a power up. Because if Kuhn got Ennis and a call, and then Bam just gets power up after power up after power up. Uh, yeah, I thought Rack was going to get something when they saw him in here. Mm. Like, he was just more powerful in general. Yeah. But the first time we saw him, he wasn't... He was failing yeah, to be the same. An enemy. Was like, uh. <laughs> uh, congratulations on defeating the champion villain. You can proceed to the next stage once you find the exit. What? I thought this thing was the exit. Can you just hold up the thingy? Thank you, thank you. Oh, NPCs are grateful. Uh, slaying a minotaur, then rescuing some little villains and escaping. These sure are strange quests. <laughs> yeah. What's going on? Uh, and Dorsey, how are things on your end? We beat the villain too. I think we just have to find the exit now. On the hidden floor, you can communicate if you register each other's measuring devices. Okay, that's convenient. Fair enough. Uh, whew. So, we safely passed this stage too. I'm glad the big breeder hasn't shown up, but we still haven't found our companions. Seven stages in. 
Uh -oh. Says safely. Oh shit. Oh okay. no. Alright. Where's she coming from? <laughs> as soon as you say safely or like something like that, it's just like... This is what happens as soon yeah. as you say it. Never, never say things are going well. <laughs> never. <laughs> things might be It's going a life right. lesson for everyone. But <laughs> just accept it. Sense. Don't speak of it. He's like, I said it ironically, so I think it's okay. <laughs> what's, uh, what's this? A sudden chill? What? Coon, could it be? Oh, no. Oh, dude, I literally thought that was a thorn for a second. <laughs> like, a dark one, though. It's like a paper okay, airplane with... or a spike. Coon. An, An observer. observer. Long time no see, brother. Oh, this is definitely a sworn enemy. I never imagined I would see you here like this. That voice. Uh-oh. I'm so glad that you consider <laughs> me your sworn enemy. Oh. I'm waiting for you here. Come quickly. Oh. Okay. Or um, one of your companions might just disappear. What? Who did he get? The pink slipper. Is this um the cushion girl? Wasn't she with um in Dorsey and Rachel? Oh, we only actually we only saw in Dorsey, Rachel and um yeah, Candy. Yeah, you're right. Oh no, it's me saying. Yeah. Uh, she's a very cute girl wearing red clothes. For some strange reason, I keep wanting to kill something. <laughs> Lovely. Uh, so, I might kill her first if I can't wait. Okay. Could it be Masang? <laughs> <laughs> He's crap. We have to go and save her. No, Bam. Oh, wow. Okay. I think oh. I should go by myself. Here. Oh, wow. Really? <laughs> it's time. It's unfinished business. Yeah. For now, you guys go and look for the exit. I'll leave you with a lighthouse. Call me if you find it. She seems to be my sworn enemy, so I'll deal with her. Bam Bam should go with, I think. <laughs> no, no, no. Let Coon do it. Oh, Man he's... needs to grow. He's... I want Coon to, like, follow Bam. <laughs> We need him to the end. But Bam needs to back up his boy, alright? Sometimes the boy needs to go, like, <laughs> do some solo stuff. You know? Okay, okay, okay. He's off. Cool. Let's go. Okay. Alright. Oh. Alright. <clears throat> entering a dark space. The, like, thing he stops. I knew it. It was you. Kisea? How do you say that? Kisea? Kisea? Yeah, I think. So uh, you came alone, brother. <laughs> of course. Okay. I thought you would come with your other companions. There's no need for that. Why not? Is it because you don't want them to find out what a despicable person you are? Oh my goodness. Do you want to hide that our sister died because of you? Oh damn! Oh, okay. is that what happened? So this isn't this isn't the sister that he tried to like. What what? Did, how did they say it at the start? Like protect, I guess. In at the start. Hmm. Interesting. Pulls out a dagger. Huh. Or like a switch switch blade. Oh. Yeah. Fight me, brother. Oh. Uh, if you win. Kill me and take your companion with you. If I win, I'll take your life. On the outside, I only ever resented you. Oh my goodness. But now I want to kill you so badly I can't stand it. I should have known you were my sworn enemy. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Guess I don't have a choice. I'll just have to fight you. Thanks, brother. <laughs> mm. oh, forgive me a chance to kill you. Then she like, Speed blitzes out of there. Mm. So fast. Oh. Okay. Is that teleportation? She's going in. Straight up. Barrier. Baby Growler. Ooh, what is this? She just... Hang on, what's going on here? I don't see the barrier, but whatever this thing That's is... Looks like it's about to shoot. I think he's like putting up the barrier. 
still in process. It looks like you haven't forgotten. The growler that I got from my mother can neutralize your lighthouse. Oh. 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 No wonder this is confidence. <laughs> She's okay. the counter. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go again. <laughs> He's done this before. <laughs> this is literally the meme. <laughs> <laughs> Knife fight. Okay. Got a perfect ching in there. Blades mm. clash. It's hard to block it. The trajectory. Oh. The trajectory of this dagger coming at me like lightning. Oh. Oh no. She lands a hit, boys. Okay. Oh, a solid hit, boys. That ain't good. She get that checked. <laughs> she get that checked. Your flesh is so warm even though you're a data human. Ah. It's like you're a real person instead of data. Hmm. <laughs> Thinking. Will this appease our mother? At least a little... Wait, does Coon's mother hate him too? Oh, no. Good thing she wasn't here. <laughs> oh. What have, you, what have you done, Coon? Poor Coon, man. Yeah, what's... <laughs> man has had a troubled upbringing. I'll this give him that. This is why Bab should be here right now. <laughs> Just for moral support, you murderer. Oh no. Oof. That, that a big is, slice. yeah. That's He's a chunk. Lost considerable amount of blood there. And remember, this is Coon, not Bam. He can't heal. <laughs> yeah. Did Coon just get Coon? <laughs> He's down, boys. Send back up. <laughs> I swear, this better all end up as part of Coon's plan. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, uh, so many Coons everywhere, I think I'm in love. Look, I'm liking all the Coons. All of their designs like. are so clean. Yeah. Uh, and then there's a happy new year. All right. Next one. Whew. 363. Straight new murderer. Straight where we left off. Oh no. Two. Oh no, no car. <laughs> oh, okay. He's like, he says blood. his name when he gets hit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I'm so happy. You may be a data human, but at least I got to kill you like this. He's not dead yet. It's just a flesh wound. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Um, Why did it take me this long to do something so easy? <laughs> oh Why did the me goodness. on the outside lack confidence like that? <laughs> uh, it's still, it's okay. This vivid feeling of piercing, living skin, and spilling blood should be enough to make me feel like I killed you. Hmm. Does your data feel pain too? Or do you feel as much pain as our sister did? Okay, now she's just rubbing it in. Half of the Coon family may be a little bit insane. I just want to say a that. A little? Now. A little? <laughs> of uh, course. I opened the gate and came here myself. I'm not Dada. If I die here, I'm really dead. Oh, there you go. Alright, now... Going for the final Let's blow. Let's end this. Come oh, on, Coon. Get up. What you got here? Uh, Coon Adan, part six. Oh, <laughs> damn it, another dead end. Come on, Zoro. Oh, uh, this place really is a labyrinth. It'll be hard to find the exit here. Hun saying you, how are things on your end? Uh, nothing to report yet over here either. We are not even sure where we are, let alone finding the exit. And then Rax, something's caught Rax's attention. Oh, is he going to throw a spear at something? Oh, yes. Wait. Okay. Is this Rax's ancestor or something? What's going on here? It's a good portrait. <laughs> <laughs> he has longer spikes than Rack, though, I think. Mm. Me? Oh, never mind. Me? Oh, oh, okay. This is Rachel, I guess, doing this. Let's try using the big breeder's abilities. Okay. Oh, okay. She's just cheating, trying to find yeah. that way out. Is it She's that got way? hacks, boys. What is, what is Rack doing? It's this way. This way leads to the exit. Huh? Uh, bam. Icarus says she found the exit. For now, let's check it out. Okay. Dude, Bong Bong is OP in this series. <laughs> oh, God. You have no idea. It's so convenient. Oh, spider. Hang on. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> Alright, we're good. He's on the floor now. <laughs> 
Let's end this. All right, knife's coming down again. There's Still the psycho part gone. that I was talking about, by the way. Yeah, I can see it. Oh, what's he trying? Oh, yes. Oh, just tackle. The, the classic. Like <laughs> okay. She took a hit. Coon's on the floor again. This pathetic behavior isn't like you, Aguero. Oh, a smug face. He's vanished. What? The knife is still there. Wait, he had, what do you mean he's vanished? Oh, the hostage is gone. <laughs> nice. Uh, while you were focused on me, I moved the lighthouse to somewhere far away. Since I can't defend myself with it anyway, I thought it'd be good to at least save the hostage. Okay. He's thinking ahead, as always. You were so concerned with me that you didn't notice at all. It's probably already gotten very far. <laughs> Damn it. Using up the lighthouse, your last resort to save your companion. That's not like you, but it doesn't <laughs> matter. You're my target anyway, not that hostage. Hmm. No, I just need you to die. Oh, my goodness. You need to calm down. Oh, here comes the lighthouse again. Teleport. He's out his voice. Oh, yes. Big brained it. The lighthouse. It's not far away. It's right up there. Okay. What's he gonna do? Sorry. I actually lied about moving the lighthouse far away. I tried to distract you so that you wouldn't activate the growler. Oh, what's he got planned, boys? Because there's something I have to do before I die. You can't die here, Coon. Uh, this isn't real. This really isn't like you at all, brother. You weren't the, the kind of person who would be so foolishly attached to data. This is true. He has changed a lot since he started. How long do you think you'll be able to last there? You'll die in your current state soon anyway. Oh, ha, ha, ha. I will not die until I become the leader of the Coon family. Ooh. Oh damn! Is but, this the first time we get like Coon's resolve? Yeah, I think so. This is the first time we've heard anyone say this kind of stuff. Is this One Piece? I like it. <laughs> Let's go. All right. When I become the leader, there's a lot more stuff for me to do. Oh yes. Oh. Uh huh. You the leader? What a bunch of nonsense! We found the exit. Oh yes, get him out of there, boys. Uh, how can uh, you say that, knowing what kind of person your father is? They found the exit. Well, that's all for now. I actually left a lighthouse with my companions. Oh, he's just going to TP. <laughs> uh, so they could send me coordinates to teleport to them when they do find the exit. That's why I'm more focused on saving the hostage than beating you. Dude, Kun is a genius. <laughs> Needs is. to be said again. <laughs> See you later, Kisea. Oh. Aguero? <laughs> and they're gone. <laughs> Outplayed. Oh. He does still have that stab wound. Then yeah. Rachel's OP. Maybe she can just... Heal him. Yeah. Coon. Oof. Uh, will she heal him, though? That's the thing. Coon, are you okay? Hurry. My sworn enemy. Oh. Let's move on to the next stage now. Oh, oh. Somebody heal him first. Come on. Okay. All right. Activating the portal, boys. They're gone. Coon, he's bleeding too much. He may be in danger if he continues. Hmm. Let me try healing. Holy, I'm. This is beyond <laughs> me anymore. This is like. I like. Icarus. How can Rachel be so useful here? This is no longer Rachel. This is Icarus. She's standing in. <sighs> Icarus, new best girl, confirmed. <laughs> yes. Gives Rack an upgrade, heals Coon. It's crazy. <laughs> what is going on? You can heal people too? I'm not totally sure, but I'll give it a try. Okay. Just like Chung told me. Oh, oh please recognize that. Big, yeah, big breeder power. Yeah. There that it is. marble. It's the big breeders. Okay, thank goodness. Okay, she's giving him energy or something. What? Huh? 
<laughs> Coon? Coon's like, wait, this is how it feels to be Bam? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> the bleeding stopped. My pain is gone too. Oh. Did you really heal me? Uh, well, uh, uh. <laughs> what an amazing ability. Thank you. You're incredible. No, no, no. Answer Coon's question. Come on, Bam. <laughs> what happened? So we have a healer now? <laughs> nah, don't mention it. That was nothing. Hmm, you would be a useful turtle. <laughs> Meanwhile. Yeah. I guess she wasn't lying about being the sworn enemy of the big breeder. But, Coon's thinking. She's he's still, still definitely <laughs> suspicious. Thank goodness Coon is here. <laughs> Can't believe he ran away. Oh, please. You stabbed him. <laughs> yes <laughs> damn it <laughs> don't feel too bad you'll meet him again soon oh my goodness what's going on here is that a Zatu anyway. oh the big breeder Juvial Grace is back who's that on the left why does that look like Hansung. kind of like Hansung yeah uh, I will help you with your revenge. Okay, so this is the gathering of the sworn mm. enemies. Yeah, not sure who this one is. Or the back one. Hmm. Who? We haven't seen many of these big things. And then no. We haven't seen any of them with wings before. Okay. Hmm. Very interesting. Uh, the hidden stage, the palace oh, of spears. Here we go, yes. boys. More Idan, let's go. Oh. What are you just staring at it for? Eat. Oh, if this man Do they even eat. need to eat in this place? Get in there. Grapes and wine? Nothing else? <laughs> what do you mean? That is what royals <laughs> eat. Come on. Oh, that person is the daughter of Kun Adan. The grapes here are very sour and sweet. <laughs> that's why Dude, I man just it. man just like lightning aura all he's, the time yeah he's permanently charged data of young Kun Edan that's so cool <laughs> one of the irregular who entered the tower with jihad he later became one of the ten leaders ruling and giving birth to numerous sons uh, he himself is also the greatest spear bearer on the tower, and even in terms of melee combat abilities, he is known to be the strongest among the ten leaders, along with the ten, along with the leaders from the Airy and Ha clans. Oh, powerful is what I'm hearing. Also, lightning spears sounds ridiculously OP. The, he truly is the god of spears. Sachi, uh, yeah, I sensed it too. Oh. It may be the data of him when he was young, but there's a very faint holiness about him? Is that? Yeah, that's that's what it is. What do they holiness. mean? Holiness. That's a very interesting describing word. It's like some... He just feels completely different, I guess. Like a divinity kind of thing? Yeah. <laughs> I think that's what they're going for. He's a god. <laughs> This is what Enel was supposed to be? <laughs> this is what Enel wishes he was. Yeah. <laughs> so, that kid who made a promise with me hasn't come here? Uh, the other guy. No, he's still on the other stage. Answers so fast. Lord Adan. Ah, I know. You wish to fight the big breeder and go attack Jihad. Go attack Jihad. <laughs> yes. To be honest, I can't understand why... Sorry. Uh, why you would lend your help in fighting Jihad? Yes, here we go. Tell us more. Well, those guys on the outside clearly called me leader and Jihad king. But that's just on the outside. Oh. As far as how the outside me became someone great and how King Jihad... And how Jihad became king. That's a separate issue. Long ago, after he cleared the hell train, Jihad received a remarkable mirror as a gift. And after that, only a few companions who received Jihad's offer left data of themselves in this world within the mirror. Then they started to live as data. And then guys from the outside also started coming in here. Only a few companions. Hmm. 
Hmm. But after a very long time passed, Jihad brought a mirror here, which leads to a new mirror world. <laughs> he said that he got it from the version of himself on the outside. He proposed to use it to move only us to a new data world. He got it from himself. That should be impossible unless he got someone to deliver it. <laughs> Uh, they all decided to go because they were tired of the guys on the outside. But I stayed here. Okay. Uh, because I noticed that Jihad was different from before. Different? Oh. Yeah. The daughter of Jihad from after I had met the outside Jihad. What? what? The daughter of Jihad. English, please. <laughs> the daughter of Jihad from after I had met the outside Jihad was different from before. He's changed. Okay, so when he... Yeah, he changed. So he left the mirror world and then oh, he okay. came back and he was different. They did say, like, he separated himself somehow. So he was he, definitely the same guy on the outside. But something... I mean... It felt like something entirely different had returned. Ooh, okay. Okay. What's going on here? Ooh, we're back. Wait, what is this? Is this a camera? Yeah. Oh, it's whining! <laughs> is is that, that him? The kid who imitated the Shinsu black hole sphere? Oh, what's going on here? Yes, that's right. According to the report from the office, he used a special power. I see. All right. I'll have to check. Oh! <gasps> For myself. <laughs> okay, Thanos. <laughs> it's his time. He's literally Thanos. Yeah, I'll buy. He's got his own little freaking I'll do island. It myself. <laughs> um, also, the gold pocket. You see all those lighthouses? Yeah. They're his. <laughs> <laughs> um, My man is broken. Yeah. He's got a sweet, like, sword-looking thing as well. Oh, my God. Okay. okay. <laughs> Kuhn is so sweet. His character development has reached a stage where his sworn enemy does not understand him anymore. Yeah. Ben has made Kuhn more compassionate and caring. I love it. Yeah. He's I changed. actually just... I just like that he has, like, a goal. And it's a good goal. Yeah. First we've heard of it, but he has definitely changed a lot. And... Mm. There's actually quite a few characters who are, like, trying to change the tower property. Mm. Yeah, it's good. A big representation to Chirac Magnificence. <laughs> Made by SIU 2018. <laughs> uh, dream on, girl, if you think you'll get rid of our... One uh, TP? OTP. Uh, OTP. I'm not Can sure. Expand. I don't know what that means either. Original trilogy pairing? <laughs> I don't know what's going on here. Anyway... <laughs> This isn't Star Wars. <laughs> What's going on? It's like original trio or something, probably. 364. Two to go. Uh, they all decided to go because they were sick of the guys on the outside. But I stayed here. Because I noticed that Jihad was different from before. Different? We're straight into this, by the way. Yeah. The daughter of Jihad from after he had met the outside Jihad was different from before. Okay. He mm. was definitely the same guy on the surface, but something... That's right. Felt like something entirely different had changed. But what is that next to him? Ominous that cape. thing with... Is that the mirror? Mm. Like, did it have a cape or was it like... We didn't see it last time. I don't think so. <laughs> okay. He was about to travel out last time. <laughs> Something, Something was completely different. I'm not sure how to explain it. Anyway, I stayed behind in this place. And after that, this place split into two. With that side being ruled by some guys known as the Big Breeders. I tried crossing over to that mirror world. Oh. To that world in the mirror. As you do. But there was no one left that I knew there. Well, there's only supposed to be like three people. The Breeders. All of the uh, all data of humans that crossed over to that place with Jihad were deleted. What? Oh. Also, look at this guy's eye. I think we said I that know. when we first saw him. 
Uh, no one is left there now except big breeders. What happened? <laughs> My goodness. Mm. That's pretty cool. You scam them. <laughs> yeah. It's... Oh, hmm. I wonder if you like... Like, when they moved into the new world, you like took their knowledge kind of thing. Assimilated. Yeah. Gathered their souls like someone else. Is Hawking going to get another <laughs> power up? <laughs> Uh, all right, so the boats are flying mm. as they do, and they're paddling it. It looks pretty cool, so they're, honestly. They're paddling <laughs> air. Uh, it's been two days since we met Coon Sworn Enemy. It doesn't look like the big breeder is going to appear here either. You know, Hansan, just tell Coon, he knows what to do. I don't know what that Sworn Enemy did, but that companion that we found hasn't woken up. So we're carrying her in Coon's lighthouse. <laughs> Taking up some storage space. The strange thing is that woman. It's odd that she healed Coon's wounds and yet she said that she can't wake her up. Does she have that bracelet because she's the big breeder's sworn enemy? Strange. strange. It's like a silence. Oh, we all notice something. Is this all of the... Are they all going to pop... Uh, ah. Why do I feel like I'm being watched? Yeah, ah. <laughs> They're just staring at him. They're like, what happened, Goon? <laughs> um, oh, it's because he's like... I feel like he's like... It's because of the resolve, he said. It's... Yeah, like, he's, he's like, like reflecting. Now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> hey, you guys. Why have you just been staring at me like that? If you have something to say, say it. <laughs> I thought your sworn enemy had a woman's voice just straight up. Nonsense, you tur nonsense, you turtle. Never stared at you. Come on, Rack. <laughs> Rack, keep it down. Uh, who is she? Is she an ex-girlfriend of your? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Jeez, <Dawson. laughs> Uh Why do I have to tell you that? Hmm, well, I guess you could call it gathering data about someone that we've been that we're going to encounter as an enemy in the future. She's so excited. You have to know your enemy to beat them, right, Ben? <laughs> right, ha ha, ha ha. Uh, I seriously don't want to know. Oh, come on, Craig. <laughs> Her name is... Oh. Kissia. She's my younger cousin. Okay. Jihad's daughter, part okay. one. <laughs> He's arrived. <laughs> Get ready to sit up. Oh, here we go. Your cousin? Like, just as you said that, I, I literally just sat up. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I will sit up again soon. I'm like slowly falling each time. <laughs> yeah, it just like slowly just decrease into the chair. Uh, yeah. Kaseya is my mom's younger sister's daughter. My mom took her in and she lived with us after losing her mother in a fight between families. See, this is what Kuhn wants to change, 100%. We have different parents, but since we've been, to, but we've been together since we were little. The three of us were like real siblings. So it would have been yeah, Kuhn, his sister, and Kisea. Kisea looked up to my older sister because my sister was the closest to be, being one of the jihad princesses from our family. But my sister was hard to get along because of her very cold personality. Hmm. Jihad princesses. Oh. I grew up with expectations from my mom, not so much expectations about me, more like expectations as a strategist to raise my sister to the position of Jihad princess. He must have, like, stopped her from becoming a princess. Uh, Kasei knew that, and she told me that she would help my sister become a Jihad princess also. I allowed it because I thought it wouldn't hurt. Hmm... Kaseya had remarkable swordsmanship, even at a young age, and she used that skill of hers to eliminate my sister's rival. We got an assassin over here. But I don't know about the other families, but in ours, fighting like this was part of everyday life. Oh my goodness. Then one day, a problem arose. My sister's greatest rival suddenly appeared from an unexpected place. Name was Maria. <laughs> They're all coming out. 
Okay. My goodness. And she approached me in order to beat my sister. Because she thought I knew all of my sister's weaknesses. And I accepted her proposal. I can't tell you why, but I had my own reason for doing so. Wow. That's very interesting. It is. Then ultimately, I got my sister disqualified and succeeded in making her a jihad princess. Making Maria the jihad princess. Yeah. Huh. As a result of that shock, my sister took her own life. So this must have been... Maria must have told him, like, what happens in the life of a princess or something. Like, what's expected and... Because... Like it's started... what I'm thinking too. Like maybe Kuhn didn't want that life for her. Exactly. Like to be free. And then but as a like but um what's her freaking name? Not Maria the Mashinista. Oh, no no no, the other one. Like Kesea and like the three of them together. Oh, okay. Um yeah. Did he not mention the name? Like just scroll up. It's I can't remember the name. Uh, not that's, Maria, that's the, right the other sister, the more one, the one that took her life. Uh, do we not get a name? Oh, uh, I think we did actually. Actually, did we? Hang on. No, we didn't. Sister looked up to sister. sister. No, no, we didn't get it. Okay. Expectations. So, sister. Yeah, what I was saying was like, um, Coon, like Coon, got told about the Jihad Princess life. And he'd rather Maria have it than the older sister. Yeah. That he was grooming for it. But then the older sister really wanted it. So she either took her life or someone assassinated her and they don't know about it. Yet. Yeah. This must, this is the starting point. Like this must have been very recent just before Kuhn entered the tower, I think. Yeah. And then she got disqualified and succeeded in Maria. And then sister took her own life. Kaseya probably hated me because of that instance. incident. I thought all of that had ended once I entered the tower. But, but seeing that she has appeared as my sworn enemy, I must have been anxious that she would appear somewhere and attack me. Well, I wonder what Marie is going to say when they do <laughs> catch up again. Hmm. Coon. Well... That's that. By the way, it's not Come a big on. deal. They just pass it off, my guy. <laughs> and Dorsey, why don't you tell... Why don't you also tell us about your sworn Oh, actually, yes, please. This mm. thing on your neck. <laughs> I heard from Bam about that thing who appeared from that gem, I mean. Yes, summon him. What is this, a background check? Oh, come on. <laughs> I told you everything. You owe me something in return. Here we go. Good job, Coon. <laughs> Ah, uh, fine. Okay. Uh, well, as I'm sure you know, I didn't have parents around when I was born, so I wandered around a lot. Wow. Okay. Uh, and then, one day as I was wandering around, there was this couple that took me in. They were very ordinary and good people considering that they were from the middle region. For a brief time, I was raised as an ordinary girl. But then one day, this thing inf appeared in front of me. It looked at me and said that I have talents worthy of becoming a princess. What? Then it told me to keep this gem that was in, that it was in. It said it would help me become a princess. This man is powerful. Naturally, I brought the gem home with me. And that night, that thing killed my adoptive parents. My goodness. Dorsey does not have a good backstory right now. Well, it didn't directly admit to killing them, but I'm sure of it. It huh. thought uh, they would get me in the way of becoming a princess. That it would get in the way of me becoming a princess. Mm. After that, I did, as it said, and became a da the daughter of a ruined noble family that was trying to raise a princess. Uh, and in that place, I eliminated the other competitors, became one of Jihad's princesses, and then that creature disappeared. What? It was only after I became a princess that I realized that this, that all of this had been part of its plan. Okay. 
Because, yeah, now it's... She's like, it's porn, I guess. So you're saying that right now, you're walking around with the one that killed your parents? Uh, well, so what? It's not like they were my real parents. Oh, come on, Endorsey. And maybe if I had lived with them, I would have remained an ordinary girl for my whole life. How could, How could a talented person like me live such an ordinary life? It would be such a waste. I feel like there's a lot going on here. <laughs> yeah. uh, I don't know what you guys think, but I'm grateful that this thing enabled me to live as a prince, Jihad princess. Or well, maybe there's not a lot going on here. <laughs> hmm, it's hard to tell. Okay. She's lying. Good job, Queen. Thank you. <laughs> and Dorsey really didn't hate that snake. It wouldn't have appeared as her swan exactly enemy. Exactly right. Exactly. We're here. Oh. Right. It's Claydol again. Yes. <laughs> They're driving That's the boats. the town in this stage. Wait, why is this... Town, the Golden Dome. We know who has one of these. <laughs> this is Jihad's place. Dude. Oh. I would say. Oh. Okay. Wow, it looks like we found a pretty decent place this time. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, what's happening to Rachel? Or is that like a mountain in the background? <laughs> she, her head's I like, think it is. It's like a pillar. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I can sense it. Someone is over there. Oh. Maybe it's Yura. Oh, okay. Oh, no, it would be Wangnan. We haven't seen Yura yet. Yeah. Okay, they've arrived. These things... They look pretty cool, actually. What is this? It's like a car. <laughs> uh, hello, warriors. I am the head of this town. I will guide you so that you can receive the quest. Be careful, Bam. This is the big breeder Huang's territory. What? He is the most leader-like, even among the big breeders, although I still haven't seen him. For now, let's split into teams and look for our companions. We can beat the quest after that. I'll follow the head of the town for now. Sure, let's do that. And Dorsey, take Rack to the highest place around here. Sigh. Alright. Our spear bearer needs a good position to snipe from. Um, bam. Could I have a bit of personal time here for a minute? What? There's something that I want to check in this town. Oh... Something that you want to check? Yes, it will only take a moment. I'll make sure I'm able to return immediately if any fighting occurs. Wait, what? Oh, she just... She, just, she okay. wants to go away. Okay. She doesn't <laughs> want personal time with Bam. Yeah, that's what I thought of man. I was like, what? <laughs> well, it's not like we can stop you. Still, be careful. Thank you. I'll be right back. Mm. Tap, tap, tap. <laughs> El suspicious. Yeah, track her with well, the lighthouse. Shall we get going too? He is going to track her with the lighthouse. No, I hope so. <laughs> All right, walk in the streets. It's a big, it's a big place. place. Yeah. yeah, it feels way more sophisticated than the town we saw before. Definitely. Uh, I don't see any data. They're all robots. Could they have some connection to the people we saw in the quarantine area? Perhaps. Shall we split up and look for them? I guess so. I'll try looking around inside the dome. Alright, I'll check with the outside with the lighthouse. Call me right away if anything comes up. The big breeder might even show up. Okay. Okay, we got some nice gems in the side of the gold building. Oh. The central dome. It doesn't look like there's anyone around. Interesting. Uh, that looks like the seed that we saw in the quarantine area. Hmm. Oh. So, <laughs> you're the kid who imitated the Shinsu black hole sphere. I'm doing it. I'm sitting up. <laughs> I'm sitting up. <laughs> what? Eh? <laughs> there he oh. is, dude. <laughs> oh, no. What? <laughs> A human. Where did he come from? A human. Wait. Huh? Uh, you must have learned that from the guardian on the train. Although, you're still sloppy. 
a human. Mogginus. What is that? He looks like Wongnan. Like, oh shit, Sherlock. <laughs> <laughs> like we said that already, but uh, did you come in here through the gate too? You must be one of those. What do you call them? Irregulars. Irregulars. Hold, Hold on. He's such a kid though. He's so young, yeah. He even acts like he's so young. And what are those sunnies? Like yeah. those glasses? Yeah, you can almost see his eyes. He looks exactly like Wangman if he takes that off. Although he has... He even has the fang, man. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Irregulars. Okay. Rack, Rack and, and Dorsey. Dorsey. At the highest point. What is it, alligator? I can't believe it. Oh. What is this incredible, unsettling <laughs> feeling? Is it Rack's sworn enemy? Is the, the sea monster come back? <laughs> Who are you? Yes, please. Uh, who are you, sir? How could you not tell? I am the one who will become the king. What? The king? You mean, what is... I don't know how I feel about his get-up, eh? He's so young. Yeah, you're right. Like, like he's literally 12. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. I am the one destined to rule over the very top of this tower, the first and greatest adventurer in this tower, with the red, with the red third eye on my forehead and a crimson cape wrapped around me. Okay, this is a fanboy. Surely this isn't the. <laughs> Never mind. I am Jihad. Oh, what's with this intro, dude? <laughs> what? Interesting. He's, he's literally a kid. Uh, yeah. Honestly, Jihad looks like a kid who wants to be a superhero instead of an adventurer. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Kuhn. Well, because of a personal reason, I betrayed my sister and she committed suicide. It's no big deal in Dorsey. This snake guy killed my parents when I was a child. Whatevs. <laughs> what is going on? Kuhn wanting to talk about his backstory. Meanwhile, Rack, I seriously don't want to know. <laughs> Doesn't care about the past. And he cares about the present. All right, let's get straight into this. I need to see more Jihad. Who are you? That's a good question. Well, it looks like we're getting a recap. I am the one... I am the one who will become king. The king. king. You mean, oh. that's right. I am the one destined to rule over the very top of this tower. The first and greatest adventurer in this tower with the third eye of my forehead... On my forehead and a crimson cape wrapped around me. Mm, the red third eye. I, I am Jihad. Jihad. Where, where are you going? Yeah, uh, no, we're fine. Where are you going, alligator? Hurry! Of course, he's running towards it. The black turtle is in danger. Oh wait! Oh, he senses. How does he know? Oh, Rack has Bam sense. He's lost him once. Mm -hmm. He's not going to lose him again. <laughs> what? What? We <laughs> get there. <laughs> Jihad's data. Number Part two. two. Jihad. Jihad. So this... So that guy is the king of the tower. Mm. Jihad's data. <sighs> <laughs> I don't know, man. It seems strange. It does. Also, what is this? Is this his sword? He had it out earlier, I guess. Yeah. You're not as scared as I thought you'd be. <laughs> Pardon? <laughs> you must still not realize who I am on the outside. So, where are you from? Well, I'm not sure. Oh. Yeah, I don't know where I came oh. from. <laughs> it's more likely. I was trapped somewhere from the moment that I was born, and I still don't know where that was. You don't know where you're from? What a strange kid you are. <laughs> you're the one who's full of secrets. I'm also from the outside. But unlike you, I wasn't trapped anywhere. The place I came from was very vast and spacious. Hmm. You came from the outside and you don't know where you're from. You know about the real me, but you don't serve, seem to serve me as a king. <laughs> uh oh, this could get dangerous. Yes, very interesting. It was worth coming here in person. 
They're like the oh, same okay, age. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Shit, I'd say this Jihad is younger than Bam. Yeah. King Jahar, there's something I would like to ask you. What is it? By any chance, do oh. you know someone oh. named Arlene Grace? This could be a little Straight bit, to the big question. This could be a little bit of a trigger, Bam. <laughs> you need to be careful with that. <laughs> yep. Yep. Ah. Uh, oh, no. What is going on? No. What do you mean, no? No. Is it a young... Or is it like a... No. <laughs> <laughs> we'll find out. It's not like a de- definitive no. It's more like, oh shit. Yeah. No. He- <laughs> hmm. Okay, so someone's bouncing around. Oh, Rachel's going for Euro. I can feel it. It must be my companions. They're over there. Dude, if she's getting baited, <laughs> that other <laughs> breeder is dead. <laughs> Okay, walking into a cave, nice. Oh. Of course that's who the last person is. <laughs> He's the guy from the workshop battle that was looking for Emily. Oh my god, are you serious? Yeah. Why has he been hooded this whole time? <laughs> <laughs> He's not even that important, what the fuck? <laughs> mm, interesting. I mean, we got wh- White's up. He's not lying down anymore. He stood up. What happened? Traveller Hawking. Okay. Shh, keep it down. What? Who are you? Duh, Rachel. Well, uh, how am I supposed to explain that I'm Rachel? Yeah, you really didn't think this one through, did you? Uh, whatever. Anyway, shut up and be quiet. This is an important part right now. An important part? What's going on here? What are they doing? What's so important about it? What the hell's Yuraha doing? What is she doing? Oh. Wait, those two. Is this a sworn enemy? Uh, it could be sworn enemies in her case, right? Wait, why has she got a VR headset? What's going on? I'm confused, man. Is this the big breeder? Like the third one? Could be. This one, right? I'd, I'd say one of these is her sworn enemy, maybe. Hmm. <clears throat> All right, Yura, and a guy who looks like Yura. Ah, okay. Oh my goodness, the guy has stars as well. <laughs> you don't know? Uh, that can't be. Aline was one of your companions when you cleared the train. I said I don't know her. I don't know how you know her name, but I don't know that name anymore. He purged the data. Of course, he did. Maybe that's why he was different, because the Jihad, like, forgot a lot of things. Ah, uh, okay. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. No, that makes sense. Do you know what it means to become a king? Yeah, he's, like, solely focused on just the tower mm. now. Becoming a king means erasing the people around you. Starting with the people who are the most distant and hostile towards you. Does it? Ultimately, <laughs> you erase people who are closer to you. Then finally, when you have erased the person you most love, you are alone in the world. Mm. It's a okay. it's a very interesting view of it. And only the one who shines alone can become a king in the end. This is a man who emphasizes that power that Bam was shown on the train. <laughs> mm. Mm. Oh my goodness! Whoa. What's you, going on here? You from the outside. Look carefully with those two eyes of yours. What do I look like to you now? He's like got red thorns? Like spikes coming out? A human being or a monster? <laughs> Thump. Oh, okay. Oh, he's like Just shaking. showed him like a... Bam, screaming. What? I see. So you see the monster within me too. Fine, go ahead and struggle. Oh, hold on. Does he have a freaking administrator inside him as well? <laughs> Maybe. Is that what's going on here? Like the Red Thrisher thing? Maybe? I Is don't that, know. Like that's why he can change? I feel like he just like... 
it's like a like a really big feint where he like flexes his power for like a second. Yeah, but it's like he changes too. Yeah. Like uh, okay, Joe did. That's, yeah, maybe. That's very maybe. Interesting. Nothing beats death. Holy shit, the thorn's out. He's aggro. When, when it comes to ending fear, little monster. Little monster. I like that. <laughs> okay, so Bam's just immediately charging in. Oh, someone's dead. I think I think <laughs> Bam just got yeeted. <laughs> He's gone, sir. What What's that? Is that? An explosion? Oh. It's like fizzling. Oh, okay. He just stopped. Uh, Bam must have gone for the thrust and he just stopped it. Oh, wait. Mm. Oh, yeah. Yep. <laughs> yep, there it is. Okay. You have very decent skills, but your wave explosion is too light. Hmm. Why did I attack him? It's a very good question. It's like when he showed him, like, the monster, all instincts just went to destroy it. Yeah, he's just like, I need... To that thing's dangerous. <laughs> it's strange. He jumps back. I'll show you something better. Oh my goodness, it's Golden Fist. <laughs> what? Jihad style... Air explosion. Air ex what? <laughs> Iron fist. <gasps> he just shot his hand. You shoot out. at the ground? No, 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 no. That's a or straight it's like, bomb. <laughs> it's heading this or way. Or it's just like, <laughs> it's destroying the ground along its way. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> what? You know what? Bam's going to learn this. He got hit by it, boys. <laughs> we got this. <laughs> He's going to hit him with the counter in a second. Mm. Yeah, okay, this is where Bam gets yeeted. <laughs> yeah. Everything Ooh. just breaks. Oh. Oh, it that's took... some hefty damage. Mm. He's feeling that one, boys. He's on the floor. A wave explosion is supposed to make contact with your opponent and disrupt the Shinsu in their body. You know that, right? Yeah, this one but just think about your it. insides. <laughs> If you could control the Shinsu flowing through everything in this world, you could control the Shinsu in that person's body without even needing to touch them. Oh, no. Got a freaking bloodbender over here. Oh, you pretty much. <laughs> oh, no. So, do you want to tell me now? Who are you? And how do you know Arlene's name? <laughs> or, so that was a lie. <laughs> Bam. Black Turtle. And Dorsey. He's like, we weren't ready for this. <laughs> Look at him. Little superhero. He's doing his stuff right there. You. <gasps> Wait. Can't be. Oh, does Has she... she seen Jihad before? Oh, I don't know. Or does she... is she seeing the monster right now? No, no, no. She'd be seeing Jihad. Mm, there's a bit of silence. Uh, we've got some... Uh, irritating intruders. I've changed my mind. I'm going to do something a bit more extreme. That doesn't sound good. Also, Bam's sitting up. <laughs> Tell me who you are, or you'll die here. Oh. If you don't tell me the truth, I'll make you and your companions here disappear forever. That ain't good, lads. He's powerful. He's just, he's just holding a freaking... Like Cat. his own Shinsu bomb. He's got a hurt. Shinsu black hole orb. Yeah. That's good. <laughs> Oh, yep, yep. With the sure. Shinsu black hole sphere of mine. Oh my goodness. Nope. Oh. Oh. oh, he senses it. Please, please. A sense here, yes. Bring me the mirror that leads to the other side. <laughs> I think he's making a move. Oh. Wait, is that the last no, one? Man. Oh. <laughs> no. Okay. Next, next chapter is oh. going to be great. The comments are right. <laughs> Wednesday is where it's at. <laughs> you do know Arlene. You're just not going to admit it because you rejected your ass. Man up Jihad. Or change your outfit. That's obviously why you got rejected. <laughs> I mean, I don't mind the outfit. I just... I, so it's not young. what I expected from Jihad. Yeah, he's young. Like, young, young. Like... Like, especially from, like, Adan. Adan looks like he's, like, 
18, 20, yeah. like in that range. Yeah. Like, But this Jihad looks like he's bloody 12. Exactly. And if this is from the second time he's been to the tower, like, how old was he when he... Yeah. So young. It just... It's a uh, bit different. Less intimidating, for sure. So Bam got hit by a new ability. I wonder when he'll pick <laughs> it up and give uh, Jihad some of his own medicine. Exactly. Now, I realize what... Jihad hit him with isn't a new b ability, but if Jihad uses an ability unfamiliar to Bam, don't forget to leave a like in the chapter. That is a good point. I didn't <laughs> do that to any of them, but this one. <laughs> uh, okay, let's all remember this is our Bam who learns skills by getting hit with them. Yes. Yeah, I think he does know it. Like the comment above said, it was just like way more powerful. Oh yeah. But um, yeah, very good chapters. We got a lot of pretty much a lot of character development in this one i feel like um, Ooh. <laughs> it was a good set of chapters it actually. was like, yeah very interesting like they're not like i mean that chapter was action ish mm. well, but it's more like the character development was far, far exactly more interesting exactly from like coon and dorsey um you not get so that little rack. bit more on jihad and then adan as well mm. And I, then, it, yeah. then Coon's like family. I guess we did get a little bit of seeing Rack's character, but it's just the same Rack. Give him no, power, he'll take it, you know. Rack, Rack is simple. <laughs> Me oh, strong. Yes. New spear, I'm in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ooh, but, uh, okay, um, I'm, I'm just keen to see Adan. Oh yeah, and we did see, like, we got a lot of Coon family in this. Like, Oh no, it's great. <laughs> we saw Maria, Mashton is in here again. Mm-hmm. And we learn about his sister a little bit. I have a feeling I was very close to like mm -hmm. when he entered. But yeah. All right. Um, that's it from us. Solid chapters. Very solid. Next one's going to be fantastic, boys. Oh, we ready. ready. <laughs> oh. Tomorrow night. Cannot get here soon enough. <laughs> um, let us know down below what you thought of the chapters. And if we messed anything up. But try refrain from spoilers. Yes, uh, yes. I don't think we messed anything up. I think we understood it pretty well. I think we did alright this time. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, let us know down below. And we will catch you guys for the next one. Oh, yes. Thank you very much for watching. We'll catch you later.